Hey. Hey, baby. I was just going in there to watch you. You missed it. Shit, really? I'm sorry. I got a phone call. I had to take it. Look, I know you're going through a lot right now, but I really needed you in there, and you're out here smoking weed. Okay, but I didn't come out here to smoke weed. I came out here because Diana called, and I had to take it. I'm sorry. I, I needed you in there. You were my lifeline. You knew that. First of all, can you just... Why did you bring your award out here? Trent, way to make me feel bad about it. You look like fucking Anne Hathaway at an Oscar party. Just put it <laughs> fucking down. crazy, Amy. I wanted to make that speech to you. You knew that. We talked about this. I know, and I really wanted to see it. It's just that I'm terrified that I'm going to lose my job right now. Like, you don't understand. That doesn't matter. You shouldn't have your phone on in the middle of my speech anyway. That's so disrespectful. All right. Goodbye. I don't what, know. What do you mean, what goodbye? What do you... Where are you well, going? I'm leaving. We're fighting. We're, we're not going to talk for a few days. That's how this works. No, that's not how this works. We're just having a fight. Couples fight. They do that. It's normal. What are, what are we doing? What do you want from me? Aaron, as a matter of fact, why are you even with a girl like me? I don't understand. I love you. Jesus Christ, why do you keep saying that? Because I mean it. I love you. I'm crazy about you. Ugh. We're just having a fight. I mean, you insulted me, we're talking about it, and we'll work this through. I don't understand what's wrong with you. Why you want to be with a girl like me? I'm a drinker. Haven't you noticed? I've I don't always care. Had a drink no, in my I don't hands. give a shit. You don't? No. I've slept with a lot of guys. I don't care about, care about that. How many? I don't know. How many girls have you slept with? I've slept with three women. Well. We have that in common. I've slept with three women too. How many guys have you slept with? I don't know, like this year? This or... year? You know what? Fuck this. No, come on, I'm Amy, don't just say fuck this. this. You know, it's obvious. It's clear. You should be with, with one of those cheerleader girls. I don't know. What's Amy? You know which girls I'm talking about, right? No. The Texan with the, the big tits and the big hair. And when you get married, she wants to be more conservative, so she gets the smaller fake tits and they still look amazing. And that's the kind of girl you should be with. You know, the thing about cheerleaders is that they bring people together and they make them feel good about themselves. They actually make them feel happy. Unlike you and your friends at that magazine, that all you do is you poke fun at other people from, and you judge them from the far. Right. Because if you don't try, then you can't fail. Right. That's why you're so threatened by these cheerleaders. Exactly. Exactly. You exactly. got me. You know what? I'm going to do the surgery, all right? We're going to take those two days off and then I'll come back and we'll talk about this. Great. You know, that's fine. It's... We're done here. I can tell. What do you mean we're done? What does that mean? We're finished. I, I can tell that we're finished. I don't have to talk to you anymore. Their interview's over now. My boss said you were too boring. I just don't see.